life. What up, guys? This is Chivo Guides, back here again with another achievement guide. Today, we're going to be focusing on looking for aliens. This game is published by Chili Dog Interactive, and it was developed by Alawar as well as Eustace Game Studio. This game actually has a total of 58 achievements, and you can get the full 1000G in just about 10 minutes as long as you know the cheat. I'll be showing you guys a cheat code today that's going to help you guys skip levels making this a much easier completion it does take a few minutes to skip through the full game and we do have some miscellaneous achievements so you're going to want to make sure to follow along now on top of this being an easy 10 minute completion the game is only six dollars and 99 cents if you guys are interested in picking it up, I'll have a link down in the description below as always. Most of the achievements are related to level progression, so once we get the cheat in, it's going to unlock plenty of them. However, we do have achievements related to eating 100 items, to interacting with 100 humanoids, and then for turning on 50 monitors. I'll show you guys exactly where to get these. A matter of fact, once you start up the first level, you can actually just tap on one of the aliens 100 times and you'll unlock two achievements related to tapping on humanoids. I believe the first achievement is for interacting with 10 humanoids and then you'll get a second one for interacting with 100 humanoids. So just keep interacting with that same alien until you unlock both achievements. Now I want to point out every time you start a new level it's going to have like a cutscene or some dialogue at the beginning of the level. You can press Y or triangle on PlayStation to skip the cutscenes. This is going to help this move much faster. Now hopefully by now you've gotten your achievement for interacting with 100 humanoids. So we can go ahead and proceed with entering in the cheat code. Now the cheat code is up up down down up up right left left right x if you're on playstation that's going to be square instead of x again that's up up down down up up right left left right x if you're on xbox or square if you're on playstation this is going to pop up the cheat menu all you need to do is select the top option which says next level and all you got to do to skip a level is click in the left thumbstick it's the same thing on xbox and playstation just click in the left thumbstick that's going to automatically find everything and it's going to automatically complete all the tasks. Basically 100%ing that level. Now I know I just mentioned it automatically completes your task, but some levels have multiple tasks. So you may need to click in the thumbstick multiple times. Every time you click in the thumbstick, it's going to pop up with a new card. If you find that the same card is popping up over and over again, that means that you've unlocked all of the task cards for this level. It's typically about two per level. After you know you've seen all of the task cards, you've unlocked all of the achievements for that level. So after that, you can go ahead and press select. This is going to complete the level and advance to the next one. If you're on PlayStation, you're going to need to press in the touchpad to complete the level. Now, eventually we're going to get to this level right here that has these monitors. You want to make sure that you interact with these monitors. You're going to unlock an achievement for turning on 10 monitors and then 50 monitors. So simply interact with this monitor 50 times by clicking on it 50 times and you'll end up unlocking two achievements for doing so. Once you get to the next level, again, it's going to start off with some dialogue or a little cutscene. You can press Y to skip that, and then all you need to do is click in the left thumbstick to automatically complete the next task. After it shows the card, click it in once more just to make sure that you've unlocked all the task cards for that level. Once it's showing the same task card, you can go ahead and move on to the next level, and we're pretty much going to do this for all the levels in the game. It's eventually going to get to the point where you've skipped the whole game using the cheat and all you got to do now is get the two achievements for eating items. Each achievement is worth 15 G so you should have it nearly completed. I'll show you guys the best level where you guys can get this nice and quick. What you want to do is scroll over to the right using the right trigger. Once you get to this level right here that has the shopping cart on it, level 18, you want to select that level. It's some sort of mall or shopping market. What you want to do is go up and to the left and eventually you're going to find a grocery store that has a ton of different food items. All you need to do is just eat a bunch of the food in the grocery store and eventually after eating 100 items you'll unlock both miscellaneous achievements related to eating food items. And that's going to cover the final two achievements in the game. After you've eaten your 100th food item you'll unlock your final achievement giving you that full 1000 G out of 1000 G. As always, I'd like to give a huge thank you to all of my Patreon subscribers. We just hit 10 patrons. I'd like to give a special shout out to everybody in the biggest fan club, including TimG84, 
Kegger 101, Kana 25, and Rock Mono 44. As always, I appreciate you guys tuning in. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a comment and don't forget to like and subscribe.